Well, hey folks, Easy 7 here, and welcome back to the channel, and welcome back to Maple Farm for Farm Sim 22. I think that's in a good spot. There we go. Yeah. Now I just gotta figure out. Oh. I think before I drive the truck down there. Or the truck, sorry, the combine. <laughs> I'll take this down and just make sure that uh, what I'm after is actually ready to go. Okay. These are all good. That's our oats are all good. But just down the road, I believe, we have... Uh, More crops ready. Let's hope everybody's doing well today. It is a Saturday. It is Saturday afternoon to be exact. Here on the Sunshine Coast of beautiful British Columbia. And we're having a so-so day. Looks like the sun is finally coming out and warming things up a little all right now okay all right we've got these soybeans but um, what's above those is this the other field I'm no this one's done oops so we've got these soybeans, but we can't exactly do that with, uh... What are you stopped for? I'm on my side, more or less, of the road. <laughs> so that ain't it. Um, oop. I really gotta watch where I'm going. I'm gonna, uh, Cause issuances. get our bearings here, shall we? So... Alright, field 56. That's the soybean. Oh, I see. Hmm. Okay. No, that's just the grass field. Where are we here? That's 55. 54 it should be just on the other end of this grass field. So, let's go have a look. It already. Hmm. A very large sunflower field. All right. Let's figure out if there's a way in from that top. I think this is the one that's got the kind of twisty entrance here, which is going to be really, really, really tricky. for a combine hauling a trailer. Or there's no entrance at all. Okay, here we go. This is the way up. So we're not that far off. We just have to make our way out the back of this. All right. No problem. Oh, you can't steer either, eh? Oh, well, that's great. 
You can usually still steer once you shut the motor off, but apparently not with this thing. Okay, there. Can't get out when there's a tree trunk right against the door. Alright, let's burst out here and not get ourselves run over. And we're ready to go. Oh, I never folded that freaking uh, header up. Still got all the pointy bits. Oops. Well, that can't be good. Uh-oh. Yeah, that's gonna work. Oh, it's slightly off to the side, is it? There we go. All right. Now, I can go straight through. It's not big, but it's big enough. There we go. Without driving on our oats too much. Away we go. Hope you're all having yourselves a great day. Spring is uh, rearing its head in your area. I know it was a pretty tough winter for some. In more ways than one. So. Ah. Alright, let's uh, That'll do, pig. Okay. understand how that's done. Set B. Okay. We have lines. Cutting corn. Alright. Er, pfft. I suppose we'd be cutting corn if it was a cornfield, wouldn't we? <laughs> Alrighty. I guess, uh, what I should say is we got the sunflowers under control. when we get to the end here I'm going to uh, 
run a headland across the top and I suppose one down the bottom as well wouldn't hurt and then I think I'm gonna hire up a fella I'm so high up because of the noise of this thing. Yeah. So big shout out to the viewer that left a comment the other day. Again, I'm four or five days ahead on my videos. So if you see a video where I do or say something that seems dumb because you already told me what the deal was, that's why it is not because I ignore your comments or anything like that guys so back and forth so much, eh? He's still not straightened out. They took all the way from there to here for him to actually get a final straight line going. Hmm. Well, him, I guess it's still... No, it's not, I guess. Oh, well, yeah, it's still me in there. I've just got cruise control on. Yeah. Bloody slow, too, isn't it? Is this field slightly off? I hope I don't catch the hedge here. That would suck. Like I said, I just want to get a headland and then we can hire somebody. <coughs> Excuse me, hire someone up. And we can get our trailer full of corn back home. Which is uh, going to be nice because we can throw some of it in the pigo mixer. And design our own pig food. So, yay. Actually, since I'm doing the headland, we might as well... Uh... No, that's not what I want. Um, sorry. There we go. Might as well just shut it off. The hired worker, as far as I understand, does not... Uh, does not work with GPS on, so we won't be, uh, won't be using that. Not for this, anyway. But uh, the reason I brought up uh, not getting to comments right away, one of the, my viewers, I think a new viewer actually, or might be wrong, has explained to me, <laughs> when I go into the, uh, thank you, uh, cowardness thing here, and, okay, those are all empties. 
and we look here I assumed this was to do with sort of mixing your food you know you want to get like X number amount of it but it's what it does for actual health right a hundred percent health if you feed them total mixed 80% if you feed them hay 40% if you feed them grass so and so I guess it, it almost makes sense not to give them hay or grass and just fill the whole darn thing with mixed rations. Alright, we'll get the best production that way. So, but a, a really big thanks for explaining that. I've been looking at it all wrong up to this point. Big shock, eh? So, yeah, awesome. Okay. For what it's worth, we now have a headland. All right. Let us go here. Nice. Yeah, we got a fair bit of work to do here. Like I said, I want to spray it and then we're going to plow it to match the field below it so that we have a huge cornfield for next year. Our total take was 22,500 liters. Well, a couple extra, but I mean, not enough to really speak of. But I mean, that's really good help, of course. You know, that's going to get our uh, our lead pig food going. Because up to this point, we're uh, a two ingredient kitchen looking to make a three ingredient recipe. Well, here comes the third ingredient. Oh, I noticed there was, uh, remember we tried the uh, different auger wagons and the John Deere would not unload? Yeah, I see there was a patch for it today. <laughs> Fixed unloading. <laughs> so it might even work now, which is cool because out of all of them, I liked it the best. I mean, you know. Uh, no particular reason, I suppose, but I did. All right, now, I'm not going to bother unhooking you, because... As look would have it, we have another tractor. Yes, we do. <clears throat> Just sitting here, awaiting for us. Ooh, we got half a pallet of honey. Nice. Only got one beehive. It's way over in the uh, edge of our to be sunflower field. Let's do that. You can just see it there, right at the fence line. Eh. Just before the trees. That's our uh, that's our one and only honey hivey comey thing. So I'm just curious. Stop, tractor. Thank you. My goodness. Get a little bit of roll on or what? Uger wagons. How much was the JD of deers? Oh, no, it's not here. That's quite the thing. Look at this thing. Jeez. Oh, potatoes. Okay. Beet carts. Beet carts. Oh. Huh. Well, that's odd. Was it not under, uh, Uger wagons? Oh, there it is right there. Yeah, I kind of like this one better, to be honest with you. Hmm. I think it's cheaper than the one we have. 
but only if it actually honestly truly works. Because if it doesn't and I buy it, and it still has issues. Then it sure as heck ain't cheaper, is it? I don't know. I think the only thing I really don't like about this one is it's running rice wheels. I don't know that it should be. So. Whoa. Let's, uh. Oh, that's right. You can't sell here. You can only repair. That's right. So 6,000 for the John Deere, huh? And what will I get if I do decide to part with this little Lobla? Lobla home. Uger wagons, 8,342. So I'll actually make two grand, hey? 12.9 cubes, man. Where is this guy? Uh, $2,000 less. 10.5 to 14.5. Hmm. Yeah. No, we can make it bigger. What's configuration? Oh, an extension to make it even bigger. Um, no, I don't think so. Continentals. Oh, there we go. It's a little expensive. Now we didn't save any money, but. Yeah, we did not save any money. <laughs> the base model might be cheaper, but cost us seven hundred dollars in difference. But look at this thing, it's huge. Cover off. Pop up the pipe. Look at that. It's beautiful. All right, let's go get some sunflower or corn. We've got sunflower. We need corn. My mistake. My mistake. All right, here we go. Up. Corn, please. Okay. Yeah, 22,000 ain't a lot, is it? There's darn near half of it. Probably a good thing I didn't get the extended one. That could have been really crazy. Alright. Oh, whoa! I forgot. There's a really quite the dip there. It's hard to see it, but... Yeah, there is, right there. There's quite a dip. I thought I was going to flop right over there for a moment. All right, now, this had a choice, didn't it? Yes, we're on the wrong tip side. We would like it to be... Pipe! Ah, I don't need that on now. So... Ha 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 says to start overloading. There we go. Da -da 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 -da. It's overloading. Okay. So, this has got everything. Look, it's making the pig food. 15, 16, 17. Lovely. Lovely. 
Oh, the pigs are going to be so happy. We're going to go down and tell them. How's the eggs coming? Oh, come on, ladies. Make the effort. Guess what? We harvested the corn. You guys have your own fresh pig food being made. Cool, huh? Well, there, at least one of you appreciates it. The rest of you can bother to get up. Just lay there on the ground. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, 2676. This is good timing. Because there was uh, 30, 3400 or something before we uh, changed it over. Uh, what do we got here? Where is... Ah. Uh, we need to go and empty. Oops. Oh. <laughs> You're an idiot. Oh, those are sugar beets. What are you doing, man? Don't do it. Okay. We need to go and empty our... Harvester, you're done? You are. Excellent. Okay. Back to the dear John. And away we go. Go, go, go. There you go. I really wish they'd trim those branches. I can't do it. It's not my property. That's up to the neighbor. I think he's just being a bit of a dick because, well, we kind of got rid of part of his hedge and stuff. <laughs> but, I mean, you know, be fair. One side of the hedge was mine. I couldn't help it though when I removed my side, his went with it. Um, why do I feel like this was not where I wanted to be? Um, oh yeah, it is, never mind. Eh, quit driving on the oats! So, anybody want to bet whether the pipe's pointed the right way? Nyak, nyak, nyak. Okay, up the hill we go. There he is! Oh, I see him off in the distance. You doing a good job, man? Oh, yeah, you doing a good job. Good, good. And, well. Yeah. Some odd bits, but I think we're used to that. And there you go. Who we got working for us, anyway? Do, 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 do. Huh? Oh, right on. Look like a little bit of auditness up here as well. Do, 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 do. Nope. Perfect. Love it. Alrighty. And still emptying. You're done, are you? You are indeed 13,500. That's the standard amount. Nice. Now, of course, we can use these for pig food or oil. So, don't think they'll keep in mind. Now, back to the farm. farm, farm. Not you? Yeah. So, we'll lay that down, we'll put the lid on, and we'll go park it like we own it. Because, well, we do. I love these trailer sheds, eh? <laughs> what are you going to you going to park in there? Nothing. Why are they so big? Because they're trailer sheds. 
Okay, this thing is really kind of... Uh, so we want to get it over the edge because we still need to park our big trailer, right? Eh? Well, I think that qualifies as the edge. <laughs> Perfect. All right, now what we need is... The sprayer. Ooh, this thing has been sucking in the bales, eh? We'll have to keep an eye on that. We don't want it to run out. We do have some in storage over in our ground bunker, but... Still. And how are we doing for spray? You. Well, actually, that's probably going to do. This isn't a terribly big field. Although I am going to want to do the one the sunflowers are in as well. Probably. So. Um. Yeah, we got the money. What the heck. Turn it around. Might as well fill it, you know, well, not fill it, but add some to it. There we go. And into these, and these, and this. Details, yes, please. Yeah, good enough. Good enough and good enough. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Boy, do you think I actually get away with an episode without sneezing? I bloody wish. Please, sir, can I have some more? Alright. Now we'll be able to do a field or two. I haven't risen up on my back bits yet. No, I can still steer. I guess that's enough weight. It's not a very heavy weight. I think it's 650 kilo. So we're probably not that far away from... Being a bit light in the tires, as it were. Ooh, I think I pulled right in front of somebody. Hmm. I imagine I'm supposed to care about things like that. Okay, let's go. Um. Well, it's only 30 something percent full. Okay, where was the entrance? Oh, uh, this will do. No, it won't, apparently. And to pick a place with a frickin' stump in the middle of it. Okay. What's gonna be the best? Oh, this is, yeah. Don't really need to worry. I just need to come over here. Unhinge it. Um, actually, I think we are probably a little late in the episode to start a new job. So... I'm going to get her all unfolded, make with the pretty look, there we go, look at that. Okay, then I'm going to hop out, walk all the freaking way around it, and go see how, uh, how everybody else is doing. This is doing really nice, eh? Looks good anyway. The numbers say it's gonna suck, but I I don't really think it is. I think we're gonna be just fine. Huh, you can't walk on the hedges. In case anybody was wondering, I mean, you know, I'm just putting it out there. But, but, um, yeah, we're gonna have a a fair tumble of the oat, aren't we? Hmm. Indeed. But I have a plan for those there oats. Oh, do. Uh, hmm. 
Huh. You're going the wrong way, aren't you, bucko? You're only 50% full. Really? How much more you got to do? Ooh. Well then. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to disturb you. Um. Yeah, I might as well drive this one. So, hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, remember to hit that like button. It helps out a bunch. And if you're new to the channel, maybe consider subscribing it. to it. Subscribing it? Hmm. Anyway, take care of each other, folks. Ciao for now.